Nearly 80,000 fans are expected to fill Razorback Stadium tonight. And we spoke with some fans who traveled across the country to see Garth Brooks perform right here. Garth Brooks! <laughs> Annie and Angela Cunningham traveled from upstate New York. He's a family artist for us. Whenever we all get together, they just recently moved back to New York. We always play Garth Brooks around the fire, so it's 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 a wholesome sort of thing. From friends in low places to just I love the old school stuff. You know, I love the river. Standing outside the fire, yeah. yeah, all of them. Brooks is bringing the bright lights of country music to Razorback Stadium. You know, I love the show. Love his music. Been a big fan for years, and you know, I've always heard. Like I said, I've always heard it's the best show you'll ever see. So nearly eighty thousand fans will be singing along. Well, that was one reason we wanted to get tickets was because we figured it was a once in a lifetime chance. And from the wise words of Garth Brooks himself, we're going to promote being loud, and we're going to promote staying up way too late. I, I like I can get behind those things. It's going to be a party. We'll be rocking, that's for sure. Uh, you know, it'll be rocking during a football game, maybe rocking more tonight. In Fayetteville, Kendall Ashman, 4029 News. 80,000 loud and strong. And if you're headed to the show tonight, you'll want to plan ahead. Lots of changes like road closures and ride share details. You can see a traffic flow map right there on your screen. Parking passes for university controlled lots are sold out, but you can always take an Uber or Lyft. Now here's a look at the drop off and the pickup map here. There's also several parking garages and decks in the area.